What is up guys, K2 Commando here, and I am bringing you another commentary on the game Black Ops. And it's a sniping gameplay on Hanoi that I got recently today. Uh, I haven't sniped in a while on this game, so I figured why not, and I'm going for it. A uh, lot of, I start off with a great kill streak, which I'm, I was kind of upset that I didn't put anything on higher than a care package, because usually when I snipe I just go really low, but I start off great with a nice three piece here, two, and this guy has second chance, always bums me out, but he dies from Nova Gas, so there you go. Um, what I do want to talk to you guys about is all the new stuff that's happening. Again, the Modern Warfare 3 Spec Ops uh, trailer came out, and a little tidbit at the end of the multiplayer um, about a, a point streaks and things like that. It looks awesome. Uh, I love those type of survival zombie type of things. Um, for the survival mode, there's a lot of nice things. You can buy perks, you rank up, you can get more things. Uh, you can call in different types of squads, like a Riot Shield squad or Delta squad was one of the options, and they'll come help protect you and help you fight in them. So that looks awesome. Um, I'm sure all of you have seen the trailer, and if you haven't, um, go check it out on YouTube. Thousands of people probably have it up on their channels. It looks insane. Um, you start out kind of like zombies. You know, you have a pistol. It's only two player, but you have a pistol and you have to complete wave after wave and with each wave comes different challenges and things like that. Unfortunately, I never liked them, but the Juggernaut is back and I didn't really like the Juggernaut. He was a bastard to kill and he al I always died every time I faced him, so I'm going to have to figure out how to kill him faster. I'm sure there's some secret method to everything on how to kill him, but until then... Let's talk about the new map pack for Black Ops that's coming out, which is an all-zombies map pack, which I am stoked for. Uh, they're releasing a new map called Moon, and in Moon they have the new wave gun, which cooks zombies inside out, and a new perk that is thrice the zombie slaying fun. And from what it sounds like, it's just it's probably something with three guns or... Um, Something like that, or you can have uh, multiple upgrades and things like that, pack a punch. But I am looking forward to that. I love zombies. Um, I would do more zombie stuff for the channel, but I don't know if it's that entertaining to you guys. If you want to see zombies, go ahead. I can do a zombies game with a bunch of my friends, and we can just see what round we get to and have a lot of fun doing it, because zombies is a lot of fun. Um... When I usually try to get the high rounds, I'm like try hard zombies, and when people mess with things that I'm doing, it gets a little, a little tense. But whatever. Usually we just play it for fun and lols and things like that. So I cannot wait. They're bringing back all the four maps from World at War, and the World at War maps were always fun. Um, Darius was my favorite. I'm looking forward to playing Verrucked because, like I said before, I've never played Verrucked, and um, I just can't wait. There's probably going to be a bunch of new Easter eggs and things like that. A whole slew of achievements. There's rumor that this might be the last um, zombie map released for a while or ever. But I, I don't feel like that. They're prob if they have any good business sense, there's so much money in zombies and things like that. Why would they end the series now? Um, the only way to... to the only thing to do is to keep it alive and, uh, you know, maybe even make just a game of zombies, a bunch of zombies maps, different modes, things of that nature. Just go all out with it. Um, I know I would buy it because it's, it's a lot of fun to play zombies. So that's coming out. Um, Modern Warfare 3 is releasing a bunch of new stuff. Call of Duty XP is coming up, so we're going to see Modern Warfare 3 multiplayer trailers and things like that. And also gameplay, so I can't wait for that. Um, they're bringing in a lot of new guns, a lot of old guns, and um, hopefully a balanced multiplayer, but there's still that fast-paced thing to it, or element to it, so that, you know, it pleases both crowds of balanced yet fast pace. There is quickscoping, which I love. As you can see, this is a sniper gameplay, so I love quickscoping, uh, and sniping in general. It's a lot of fun. Uh, I feel like most snipers, the at least the ones you unlock in later levels, 
should be one hit kills in certain areas maybe if you don't hit him in the foot i can see if you hit him in the foot no but at least chest up it should be i know they say it is but there's a lots of times where you hit him in the chest and things like that and they just never die and hit markers can be a bitch but hopefully they work all the kinks out and they just make it a great game um also i heard from call duty xp anyone who's going and i'm sure they already know but apparently you get a free um, hardened edition of Modern Warfare 3 when you go. You you don't get it early, but you do get the Call of Duty hard, uh, Modern Warfare 3 hardened edition uh, the day it comes out for free, which is like 80 bucks included in your ticket price. So I think the tickets are like 150 and plus airfare and everything like that. But for the tickets and out of that, you get a $70, $80 uh, game out of it. So that leaves the paintball, which I'm sure is included. That's pretty good. That's like half the price of the ticket is getting the free hardened edition. Then you get the paintball, and you get to play the multiplayer reveal. So sounds like a lot of fun. Um, wish I could go, but uh, no biggie because I'm still stoked to see the reveal that was coming out on September 2nd and 3rd. I'm sure there's going to be videos posted. Um, I'll be shocked if there isn't. To be honest, if there's no videos posted, I'm probably going to be like, what is going on here? Does no one play it or do they just not care? I'm pretty sure the first second anybody's playing it, even if it's a like a camera quality video, I'm probably going to watch it because I'm stoked for that game. But that's pretty much it on the video ga game side of talking about. Um, like I said, I'm going to do more zombie stuff for when that map pack comes out. Probably... Uh, right when it comes out, I'm just going to download it, play it, and record, see what I can do. Hopefully I get to a high round the first time on Moon. Um, I'm going to have to figure out, because there's a bunch of new stuff. There's the Quantum Entanglement device. I forgot to mention. I don't know what that's going to do. But it says zombies are not infect affected by gravity as well. So it's interesting whether that will be a disadvantage, an advantage in certain areas. So I can't wait. And plus they're bringing back Shinonuma, Darius, and Verruckt, and Nocturne and Taunton. All the favorite maps everyone wanted to play. So if you think Moon sucks or any other map sucks and you want to go back to the oldies, go ahead back to the oldies because they're a lot of fun and they're remastered. I wish they'd put some of the old guns in there though. Like uh, the Wonder Waffle. Maybe hopefully they bring back the Wonder Waffle. So... Looking forward to everything. But that's pretty much it on the video game side of news. Um, but as of now, I'm back for the summer. I don't think I'm going anywhere uh, on vacation or anything. School's starting up, for me at least, in a couple of weeks. Uh, we just got our schedules in and everything like that. So, I can't wait for, I, I can't wait for school to start. I'm going to say it. I'm going to sound like a total nerd, but... Um, School, you know, it's been a while since I've seen most of my friends down there, so, you know, it's going to happen sooner or later, so might as well get it over with. Uh, I will be a junior in high school, so looking forward to that. Important year, year colleges look at, so I don't know how often I'm going to be posting to my channel, hopefully regularly, but if not, um, I hope you guys understand that there is, uh, I do have schoolwork to do. And that I do want to go into a good college and get a good good job. So, bank shot fail. But, yeah, so as of the gameplay we're going on so far, uh, I'll talk about that for the last couple of minutes. Uh, I believe I'm doing pretty well. Nice streaks and things like that. And I go and take A here. There was a part, I don't know if this is, the, no, this isn't the part, but this guy, yeah, this guy noob tubes me. And during the game, the entire time, I was flipping out. I'm like, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. And then I remembered I had flak jacket on. I'm like, okay, so this will be good. And that guy, I failed on. Should have shot, but I'm, the vines were in the way, and there was a dog barking in the woods, and then the temperature rising and things like that. And it was hot in my room, and there was this ridiculous breeze that was in loud noises and all that bad stuff. So that's why I missed that shot. All those excuses are legit, by the way. Ugh, so, I'm running around here, looking for people to snipe. 
I think I was chasing this guy, but he didn't, didn't get killed. But tell me what's up with you guys uh, in the comments, what you want to see again. I'm, I really want to hear from you guys of what you want to see and things like that. And just leave in the comments. Even if you shred me apart in the comments, go ahead. No holds barred. Just uh, go all out in the comments. Tell me what you want to see, what I'm doing wrong, what I'm doing right uh, would be nice. And please like and possibly favorite the video because it does help out a lot when you like and favorite the video. So it um, takes like 10 seconds to favorite and one second to click the like button. So if you ever feel like you need to do that, go right ahead. I'm encouraging you to. Um, it really, really helps out a lot. So thanks if you're going to do that. Um, also check out uh, the other K2 members on um, look up K2 Clash. I believe he has a uh, his channel is up and running and doing well. So anyone else on K2, I don't believe, has uh, any recording equipment. But hopefully C Clash begins to get a mic and something like that. I hope he gets a mic so we can start doing GB commentaries. But as of now, this commentary is coming to an end. We win. I went 32 and 13, I believe. So that's great. Bull me. And I will see you guys later. I am K2Commando. Uh, like and